Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for being here. In today's video, I just got a package from Sephora. I ordered some stuff. Um, I got some gift cards for my birthday, so I put it in order and I just got back from the thrift store. I'm going to show you what I got at the thrift store first. Um, and don't laugh at me, okay? Like, just y you'll understand why. So first of all, I got this super cute bright yellow sweater. It's like super oversized um, and it has this little pocket and I can just totally see myself wearing this. So this was literally five dollars I think. And then so I'm not like a huge converse. What do they call them? What's the name of them? They did not converse. Um I was just gonna say Aston Martin. Wait, what are they? Do you know what I'm saying? Chucks, Chucks. Um, but they had this, their brand new, brand new all black pair of Chucks Converse. So um, I don't know, I'm just like, okay, why not? They were 14 bucks, brand new. And I don't even know what size they are, but they kind of look like they'll fit me. So like, I'll make them fit um, but you know I don't know maybe I'll wear them maybe I'll find an outfit and I could totally see myself finding an outfit for them so grab those and then this is the thing that I grabbed okay at the checkout line of the Goodwill there is like stuff in the back and one of my best friends she's gotten like Louis Vuitton back there she got a Louis Vuitton duffel bag for 40 bucks she got like a little Louis Vuitton bag um, and they'll put it behind the cash register. So sometimes um, something like looks like no offense to coach, but like coach is like not my vibe. But they'll have something back there and you'll be like, oh, can I see what that is? And it's like coach or like Dooney and Burke or like something random. And you're like, oh, OK. But in the back, I saw this black bag and I was like, that looks like an Hermes. And then I was like, maybe it says like coach or something on it, like whatever. Then I get up closer and it literally says Hermes Paris. And I was like, yo, I was like, is that bag reserved? Can I see that? And he's like, yeah. And I was like, how much is it? He's like $17.99. So here's the bag. I just bought it like so quick because I was at the checkout and I was like, yeah, I'll have it. So here is the fake Hermes bag for $17.99 that smells like an onion soup kitchen it's like so fake I can't even like why <sighs> it smells wicked bad first of all the um handles I'll show you close up are tearing there's marks on the side there's like that white mark um and the inside so like you have to undo this thing to open it. So you like undo this, right? I mean, how in the F? Yeah, so you like go like this, you can open it up. It literally smells like French onion soup. And it says made in China. And I don't think real Hermes Paris is made in China. I think it's made in Paris. And like, just like listen to the inside of the bag. So that was like a huge bummer. <laughs> but I mean, like from far away, I'm not giving it back. Like I'm going to keep it because from far away, like, hey, not bad, but it's not real. So major disappointment. I literally was like, this is it. Like this is the find of my lifetime. I found an Hermes. What are these? These bags are like tens of thousands of dollars and I found it for $17.99 but it was made in China. Okay moving on to my lovely Sephora order. I'm so excited. I haven't made I haven't made a Sephora order in a minute. I've like gone in to just pick up like things that I've been out of but all right me and a knife are not a good combo. I think this is all new stuff. I don't think 
any of it I've used before. Okay, so for my birthday, I think I showed it in another vlog, um, for my birthday, like, gift from Sephora, I got the, um, Drunk Elephant, um, I don't know what it is. It's like a, one was the jelly wash and then one was a moisturizer. They both feel really nice, but like, I've only used them for a couple weeks, but like my skin isn't transformed. <laughs> like, I don't know if it was supposed to. Okay, why can't I open this? Okay, whatever. Well, anyways, this was only $23 and it's the, um, so I already have, oh wait, no, I don't. Oh, these are two serums. So that's what I wanted to try. I've heard great things about their serums. So these are two, the Rise and Glow C Firma Day Serum and the B Hydra Intensive Hydration Serum. So there are two like minis of the serums because this stuff is expensive. So I was not about to buy a full one if I just didn't like it. I've heard great things, but like, you know, everyone's different. So I got this, um, the like tester size or travel size or whatever and then I'm so excited about this so this is the uh Fenty by Rihanna lip gloss in Fenty Glow I think it's the Rose Nude or is it called Fenty Glow I thought it was called Rose Nude I'm confused but this lip gloss I'm not a lip gloss girl like I'm a very matte lipstick kind of gal but oh my god this is so pretty but I've heard great things like if I want to do this might just like change how I feel about um glossy lips and like I'm in my best friend's wedding and like maybe I want to do a gloss I don't know so um I'm also going to do a video using all of this stuff but I just wanted to show you first okay and then this is what I'm super excited about um, it's the new Laura Mercier Flawless Lumiere Radiance Perfecting Foundation, and I got the color 3W1 Dusk. I don't know. They, like, color matched me because they do that on Sephora. Like, you can put in what color in one foundation that you are, and then they'll match you to this one. It looks pretty good. I mean, it's definitely my tan shade. Um... Let's see. Okay, so you pull, oh, there's a pump. You pull off the cap. Okay. So I've heard, um, I've only heard great things. So we shall see. And this is definitely a higher end foundation. I don't know. How much was it? Oh, it doesn't say how much it was. I think it was like over $40. So, but a lot of it comes in it. You get um, one fluid ounce. Right, another, you know me and my little minis. I love the little minis trying new things out. So this is the um, Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base, which if you watch makeup YouTube videos, I'm sure you've heard of it. Usually comes in like a round tub. Um, this is just the little mini size because um, I just want to try it out. I want to see what it's all about. I'm like constantly in search, in search of, yeah in search of a good moisturizer and um this is like people's holy grail have used for years and love so i'm definitely intrigued and excited to try that out okay and then lastly this is i am so excited the mark jacobs omega bronzer in the tantastic tantastic you guys, wait till you see the size of this thing. This thing was 50 bucks, but I bet it will last me 50 years, honest to God. So who's raved about this? So many people. Kathleen Lights loves it. So here it is. Oh, oh my God. I didn't know there was going to be a thing on it. Oh my God. That smells so good. It's like not even just coconut like it has like a floral scent kind of like vanilla i don't i'm like so bad with trying to talk about scents um so that is it for me today thank you so much for watching if you haven't subscribed please do i would greatly appreciate it and i will see you guys in my next video love you bye